हेलो गाइज आई एम योर होस्ट और ट्रेनर माय नेम इज वरगांग पंचाल एंड यू आर वाचिंग दिस सीबीटी ऑन ए एस नेटवर्क जोन यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे आई एम वेरी एक्साइटेड बिकॉज इन दिस सीबीटी आई एम गोइंग टू डेमोस्ट्रेट यू हाउ टू कस्टमाइज वी एम वेयर वी स्पेयर ई एस एक्साइज सेवन पॉइंट जीरो हाइपरवाइजर आई एस ओ इमेज वेल इट्स नॉट रिलेटेड फ्रॉम वी एम वेयर वी सी पी करिकुलम बट इट्स रिलेटेड फ्रॉम ट्रबल शूटिंग पार्ट especially whenever you are deploying or upgrading VMware vSphere ESXi hypervisor well many time when i deploy VMware ESXi hypervisor in testing and as well as in production environment while installing ESXi host i face a challenge that some driver files are missing in ESXi iso image doesn't matter for hp dell ibm fujitsu or any other servers you are using in your environment even on vmware download portal also you will get multiple esxi iso images such as for hp servers you have hp esxi iso image or dell dell esxi iso image but still you will get error while installation so in that case my most favorite tool which always help me out and it's very handy also I personally use ESXi customizer and it's purely GUI based by which you can add your driver installation binary files in ESXi ISO image but remember whenever you are downloading driver binary files it should be in VIB format VIB stands for VMware installation bundle or also you can download your driver binary files in compressed format such as TGZ it's Targanzip. Let's move for hands-on lab so that I can show you if you are also in same trouble. So without wasting your time, you can deploy VMware hypervisor. So this is my hands-on lab computer system, and on my desktop I have already placed ESXi customizer, and also there is Land Driver installation binary file, which extension is in VIB format. and also here you can see vmware esxi 7.0 latest iso image which i am going to customize here firstly let me uncompress my esxi customizer it's in compressed format and it's done there you can see here is an esxi customizer folder just open this folder here we need to run or execute esxi customizer with admin rights so just right click on esxi customizer and click on run as administrator and here you will get this esxi customizer dialog box by which you can customize your esxi iso image and here you will get three browse button in first browse you have to search out your vmware esxi iso image path which is placed on my desktop let me open this and it's here on my desktop click on open in second browse button you need to search out your driver installation binary file which is also placed on my desktop so let me open that here you can see it's already desktop path but by default you will not find driver binary file so let me change the extension over here and there you can see vib files and now you can see it's on desktop select this click on open and here in third browse button you need to select a path where you want to save your new esxi iso image so let me browse that so here i am going to select a path on my desktop So here I am going to create a new folder so that in future there should not be any confusion between my old ESXi ISO image as well as in new ESXi ISO image. Click on OK and also click on Run button. This process can take few minutes. maybe you would also get this dialog box this dialog box is a warning message 
and it require to update your ESXi customizer. So here I am not going to update this. Click on no button. And it's done. So click on OK. And also close this console. Open your new ESXi ISO image folder. And here you will get your new ISO image. Don't be confused because it displaying ESXi 5.x custom because of I am using older ESXi customizer patch. Thank you for watching this CBT on AS Network Zone YouTube channel. If you really like this CBT, click on like button and also comment us which section you like most or if you have any query, you can also comment us.